hello and welcome to yet another exciting tutorial on this channel i am rafael adeyemo we are going to learn how to encrypt and decrypt characters and strings using vba this is a sequel to our last tutorial on how to determine pc name and hard disk drive serial number tutorials in the series packaging excel outlines the various methods that i have used to create installation packages for my Excel applications and has proven to be useful for me. In subsequent tutorials, I'll be showing why there's the need for us to add encryption and decryption when creating installation packages for our Excel application. I'm still using the last file that I created in our last session, so let us head straight to Visual Basics, click on it and then come to the Insert tab and then select a new user form let me hold down here and drag it out to give me more room i will need a text box so let me draw it out here and with text box one let me give it the name txt encrypt and increase the font size by coming down here let me give it a font size of 18 now copy and paste the text box and with this let's give it the name txt Let me select a command button and draw it out here. I'm giving the name BTN Encrypt and the caption will be Encrypt. Let me increase the font size to 18. make a copy and paste and then bring it down here and call it decrypt Let me put it in a frame to make it look nicer. This is for, just for demonstration. Double click on the user form to write the code. We are going to declare two functions one for the encryption and then one for the decryption. So let's write public. public function encrypt name as string key as long and then into bracket all as string 
string. So that is the end of our function. Let's declare this variable dim a as long dim b as string and then dim c as string two. Note that how you write the variables also affect the way the characters are decrypted. So let me add this for loop. For a equal to one to length into bracket name. Next a. The name stands for the characters that will appear in the text boxes. C will be equal to ASC and name A1. Then C is also equal to C is equal to char, which is character. Then C plus P. And then B will be equal to B and C. Encrypt is then equal to B. That is the end of our function. Encrypt PT. That is the end of our function for the encryption. And we are going to write the same function for the decryption. So for it to be faster, let us copy this, copy and then paste right here and change it to D. Decrypt and with this, the decryption is going to be negative. And the next thing that we will have to change will be this which will be decrypt we have successfully written a function let's come back here and then let us double click on the encrypt button to add the following code txtd equal to
let's run it to see Okay, so now A has been encrypted to B. Okay, so now we now have the encryption of A to be B. Let's encrypt some other more character characters. Let me write my name and then Okay, now this is the encrypted form of my name then let's write the same code for decrypt we come here and then write txt equal to That's just the code that we'll be writing for this. And now let me write my name again and then encrypt it. And let me decrypt it. Encrypt, decrypt, encrypt, decrypt. With this short tutorial, we have been able to encrypt and decrypt characters and string using VBA. With this, we have come to the end of yet another exciting tutorial on this channel. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. Like, share, comment and give me thumbs up as it will encourage me to continue to create such educative and insightful tutorials on this channel. Thank you for watching. Bye bye for now.